hey guys welcome back I just wanted to show you a build I recently completed uh, before I start painting it up this is the US M1 I believe it's A2 Abrams tank one of the main battle tanks uh, this is a Tamiya kit readily available at uh, Hobby Lobby I think it's $30 before discount so <clears throat> You know, if you get a coupon, it's actually like 39 I think. But after a coupon, you know, four times four, they take 16 off. So, it's like $24, $26. Uh, definitely a nice model. Uh, I think it's the first modern tank that I've built. I've built a lot of World War IIs, but I haven't built a lot of modern ones. Other than, obviously, the T-155, which is not modern. Um... The kit was okay. I mean, there were a few parts that gave me some problems. Uh, you could see here on this turret, I wasn't able to close that up all the way. I think I didn't get it lined up right, or there might have been some screw or some flash. Uh, it does come with a driver slash gunner. You know, you have your uh, smoke discharge uh, canisters there. And you have your uh, cage and a lot of your other modern items on the tank so I did like that the turret I don't know if the turret I think it's supposed to elevate a bit but uh, I had some trouble putting it on after I built it because you have to line up the slot with the gun and so I had to uh, re-glue it and I think I glued it shut so mine is not going to go up or down but that's not a big hassle it, it, it doesn't go that far up or down anyway the tracks were actually real easy to do, not real easy, but they, were, they weren't they were as bad as some of the other tracks. I think mainly because they were just larger size. I'm used to some of the smaller tanks with the itsy bitsy tracks, so these were a bit a bit bigger, so it made it a little bit easier for me to uh, do the tracks. But I mean, I think it's a nice model. I wanted to show it to you guys before I painted it and probably maybe messed it up. Uh, like I said, I haven't painted many much modern armor. I'm going to do it in a desert color Like it looks a little bit light green because of my camera lighting But in actuality, this is kind of a, a sandy brown and I am going to kind of stick with that uh, With my paint scheme, so it shouldn't be too hard to paint if you look at the picture here It's mostly just all brown other than the tracks and uh you know some of the apertures and things but uh just thought i'd show you guys this give you an up close if you're thinking of getting the kit uh i will see i'll bring another tank in to give you guys some comparison of the scale so this is the t55 that i recently completed and i did i think i showed you guys a overview of this kit as well i really like this t55 i'm really pleased with how it came out uh I will probably be doing this one in green too. But you can see the the Abrams is much bigger than that. And I mean these are both 148 scale, so that is not a scale difference. That is simply a difference in the size of the respective tanks. And the T55 was a big tank, right? When it came out, it was based on the Stalin platform. So uh which I think was the IS or JS2 or 3. So if you look at these tanks, I mean I mean, it is dwarfed by this Abrams. This is a big tank. Uh, I mean, I have some modern, means I'm not modern, but I have some, some World War II era tanks that I think this would be comparable to a Tiger in scale, maybe even bigger. So I do like the size. I, I never realized that the Abrams was that big of a tank. Uh, so it was kind of interesting to see how they... Uh, how it dwarfs this other tank but you know that's why I bought both of them because that gives me two kind of modern era type of tanks that may come up against each other I think they have a kit for an Israeli tank which now that I've built this Abrams I'm really itching to get that Israeli one I think it's a Merkava or something but I'm thinking of getting that I think I could do some good campaigns with the Israeli tank and the T-55 uh, maybe even the uh, Abrams so stay tuned to the channel guys I just wanted to show you this like I said before I started painting it take care God bless 